Hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2 Tropical Fun. Now the past couple of uh, episodes uh, we've been uh, tinkering around with, uh, well, uh, building up a uh, sort of hub-based uh, freight network. Now I'm doing that uh, partly because it's something to do, right? And, uh, well, I uh, these types of uh, series get boring if you don't have some sort of a goal. So I have a goal. Now we got um, some of this stuff connected up to the, um, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, the Garland uh, Freight Hub. Uh, so I, we flung some trains on the, uh, on the oil wells. Now uh, I should probably fling a train on the, uh, on the Conmats and I think yeah, that's two different trains. Uh, so I probably won't until I have uh, some stone in the network. Um, what I'm going to need to do, though, is run a uh, train between the Garland hub and the uh, Killeen uh, hub, uh, which is going to uh, need... Uh, uh, tankers on it because we want to bring the refined oil up to the uh, fuel refinery here and then we'll be able to use trucks to bring the uh, uh, refined fuel into Killeen because it's uh, close enough there's no point uh, having a train hop there and ultimately I'll probably will uh, change this setup here to uh, uh, bring everything into the hub but I'm gonna leave it alone for now uh, now I uh, don't remember what I said I was gonna do last time because why would I ever watch that back and find out now would I now uh, ultimately I'm going to end up dropping a freight hub in here I think uh, which will uh, encompass, you know, access to uh, this uh, oil refinery, the food thing, uh, the lumber, the sawmill, more oil, chemical plant, and uh, another forest. Now in here, we have two oil sources and an oil refinery. Now, it probably doesn't make sense to run uh, these through a hub, but I think I might anyway. And I think in here, I'll probably put the hub here and use uh, trucks for the oil wells, uh, a train out to the refinery and the chemical plant, um, and... Uh, yeah, because this can just take tankers. This will need tankers and a uh, uh, boxcar, I think. Um, and maybe a direct connection here, but I'm not sure. Yeah, maybe via the hub. Yeah, so I think I'll probably just bring in uh, the hub here. And it'll be uh, basically just a train and truck hub. And then I'll uh, use trucks to connect a lot of the stuff in here. Um, now I think, actually, if I put the hub here, well, then that brings the food processing plant and the oil refinery, I think, in range. And I can re rejigger the Arvada station here to encompass everything, I think. Maybe I'll do that. Anyway. Uh, what I need to do first is fling a train between the uh, these two uh, cargo hubs. Now, uh, that means I need to, um, well, obviously, it means I need to uh, fling a train on here with uh, tanker cars. Now, um, I think I can launch it from here. Okay. So I'm going to, what am I using for, for these? Uh, this is a managed vehicle. What is it? It's a Russian class S. Huh? 
Well, we're in 1914. Uh, what do we have here? That is, in fact, the question. Uh, right. Um, oh, yes, I was buying a train, right? So, um, now, locos. Uh, the class S is 880 and 140. Um, yeah, yeah, we can do that. Um, cargo. Um, tankers. Yeah, we'll grab this one. Um, that might be more than we actually need, but I'm going to start with that consist uh, because we don't have anything else going between those two hub points. So, um, yep, yeah, buy it. Uh, right. Um, oh, yeah, you're going to have to fling it on a line, aren't you? Uh, new line. And we'll go here and here. Um, what do you know? That appears to have done something sensible. Um, oh right, I have no signals on that line. Right, that's why it's doing that. Uh, and it can't do anything else anyway, so... Okay, yeah. Um, you know what? That's fine. Uh, and this is going to be the gar hub to killeen. What am I using for killeen? Uh, K L L N hub. Yep. Okay, now. To make this so I can turn around, I need to put a diamond in. And then I need to go over here and put a diamond in here. Uh, that will do. Okay, now. Uh, if I put a signal here and a signal here, that, why didn't that break anything? Uh, oh, yeah, I just, uh, yeah, that'll be fine. Uh, I'll add more signals on that line uh, and... Uh, whatever, when there's more uh, trains involved. Now, is this the train we just launched? It is. Well, let's, you know what? Don't do enough of this in this uh, series, so let's just ride the train. You know, we're coming across our bridge here, you know, the kind of obvious thing that we're doing, you know, going across the bridge and all. Yeah. So we're just ticking along here at 80k. Uh, you know, I kind of want a uh, a bridge. You know, uh, you know, the next series I do, I think I'm going to uh, put in the bridge pack that gets us back to having Jolly Green. You know, I really like the Jolly Green bridge. Uh, <laughs> You know, kind of like how the Colonel was always on about Jolly Green. Uh, I do. It is a good. Uh, it's a good bridge. It's uh, fairly compact and uh, allows. Uh, you know, allows you a good view from the top because you don't have uh, the huge railings, right? It's also an advantage of the stone arch one. Okay, now we're gonna have to wait for a train to leave. Oh my!
And here we go. Right. Uh, we're going to have a problem getting onto our track, aren't we? Why did it stop? Th Why did it pick that platform? I mean, really? It should have picked... Oh, it picked that one because it couldn't get to the right one. Well, that would do it. Okay. Uh, yeah, see, this is why you uh, test these things. So if I do this... No, that doesn't work. But I can do this. Too much slope. Too much slope. What do you mean? Okay, I can do that. Okay. That is horrid, but uh, it's just so we can get the train moving. Uh, I'm going to remove it again, because there's no way that's good, right? Uh, and then I'm going to go back and fix that on the entrance to the station so that we can actually fling more trains at it. Yeah, that's going to be uh, largely uh, unexciting, I'm sure. Uh, and the train is just about here. There it is. Okay. You are clear. Okay. I can... Uh, get that out of there. Yep. And then we need to go way back here. And... No. We need to get... Uh, we need a... Well... I think we'll bring it off here and we'll bring it what bring it up like this yep and like this yeah because that's only ever going to be used for flinging trains onto the line at the moment so I'll have to rejigger that when I extend the line uh, but that's fine now, let's just get back on here and uh, see how this looks uh, coming in on these other tracks here. Uh, here's our four-track bridge from last time. See, the left two tracks are the passenger service, and these right two tracks are the freight service. It's kind of nice to be having uh, trains that are moving along at a speed that's fast enough that you don't get bored. Uh, it's insanely bored by the time anything happens when you're running on normal speed. Uh, that's going to be good because we're getting to the point where we're running the game in fast mode. Oh, for pity's sake, I've got electrical on there. Okay, and this is one of the uh, full-length platforms where you can put ridiculously long consists on. Yep. Okay. Good. Okay, so that's running. Uh, right. Just make sure that uh, gets on its way. Meanwhile, I'm going to take the track thing. No catenary. And what? And we'll take the electrics off that because I'm not using electric trains. So I'm not going to electrify things if I don't need to. 
Okay, you can go... What? 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 Um, okay. You can be not electrified. Uh, and we'll unelectrify this. And this. Okay, yeah, that's better. Now, we aren't picking up any uh, anything from here, which probably means, right, I haven't connected the refinery up to here. Right. So that's going to need a uh, do we get tendrils? We have tendrils. We have tendrils. Now it's connected. There we go. That looks ridiculous. Yeah, it does. But, you know what? Ridiculous is fine. It's uh, connected. I'll probably redo that with a better road setup at some point, but... Anyway, and apologies for the background there, if you heard that. Uh, somebody's watching a show now. Uh, okay, so now... We have some... <laughs> some uh, oil uh, for pickup here. Uh, we have five. Okay. Yep. We got oil moving. Okay. Well, that is progress. Now, uh, since I am now going to be producing fuel, uh, let's um, take a boo here. Where, oh my, we, we want fuel everywhere. Okay, so... Uh, where can I drop it that's going to do the most coverage? Well, I'm going to need one of these. Oh, I can put it right about there. Okay, let's wang that around. And if I put it there, I get just about... Okay, that'll do. I'll wang that in there. Uh, okay, now over here, I need, um, yeah, I'll, I'll need just the one truck uh, platform here. Um, yeah, and we'll make it 30 meters. Um, right. No. No, uh, what you're going to do is you're going to go in here, and you're going to configure it, and you're going to put steps over here yeah so what's that going to accomplish it means i can put the truck station over there now i can put this over here oh no i want this on the other side um wang that around okay and we have some tendril action there. Okay. Now, uh, what we're also going to do, uh, now I want to see, does that, it covers, okay, via the station. Okay, good. Now, uh, I need a road. Uh, right. Well, I think this road will do and I need to bring it around on this side um, yeah I think I should bypass around to do that okay so we'll come out this way and we'll come out this way why don't we come out on the level let's uh, curves it. Yeah, we'll come out on the level. 
Then we'll come around this way. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll take that. And we'll, uh, hmm. Eh, I'll, uh, I'll take that. Um, well, I'll back that up just a little bit. No. This can go, hmm. You know what? Uh, if I keep that elevated... I can go over everything here, come around here, yeah, and then I can uh, edit this. Now we'll um, add another street access here, yep, good, now, now what am I Okay, yeah, I'm going to bring this out here and out here and then bring it out uh, this way and then this way. And this will give me a path around the town. Now, I think... If I mark this as player owned, the uh, town won't mess with it. And that's kind of what I'm going for here. I don't want this one messed with. Um, yeah, like that. Uh, and these ones as well. Okay, now I think I am going to need, ultimately, a waypoint here. And probably waypoints here. Okay. Uh, like that. Okay. Now, I need to be able to fling some trucks at this, so... Uh, let's, uh, nope, not on that side. We'll fling a truck depot here. Now, what kind of trucks do we have? We have the Benz Tarpaulin, which uh, carries 7 and does 40. Um, and that will carry everything. Um, yeah, I think it's the Benz. Okay. Now, we have a fairly hefty demand and a long trek, so let's use 25 of these. Buy them. Okay, now we'll add it on a new line, which we'll pick up here and go way over here and hit this and this and here and this and that really no and that yes okay now this should in theory cause this thing to produce fuel. Well, if we up tempo here, uh, we we need to get a uh, load of oil in here. So we'll need to get that in there and have it uh, and see if it uh, actually uh, eventually manages to get anything from here to the station. Otherwise, I'll have to bring this road back up here and do more tendrils. Okay. <clears throat> we have... Okay, it's working. Good. 
Okay, we're taking fuel into Killeen. Now, what's the uh, fuel demand here? 180. So, uh, pretty much as much as we can throw at it, it will take. Okay, I think 25 was roughly the right number of trucks there just to keep a steady stream going. Okay, so that will uh, definitely be uh, worth doing. Um, yeah. Okay, so this has... Uh, um, yeah, it has... Uh, uh, that will improve the uh, growth potential of Killeen, so uh, that can't be bad for the network as a whole. Uh, and uh, yeah, I think, uh, I think I'm going to call it here for this part. Uh, next part, I'm going to uh, start working on the uh, hub over here and uh, get all this stuff connected up, and then we'll see, see what I do with that, and then run a line back ultimately to Killeen so that we can uh, bring the uh, food from the farms here uh, up into the food processor and uh, yeah that will uh, at least get some more stuff online uh, oh we've got also this needs to come in as well okay right uh, so that's going to be all for this time uh, note that we're up to 30 odd million so we've got a good income happening uh, so that's going to be all for this time uh, next time, uh, more faffing about uh, with the freight network. Uh, anyway, um, don't you know? Stay healthy. Don't let the zombie apocalypse get you down. Uh, and I'll see you next time.